This Tai Chi for Rehabilitation program, or TCR, was derived from the Tai Chi for Health Institute and developed by Dr. Paul Lam. Before I guide you through these movements, I'd like to remind you of some principles of practice. First, movement. The control of movements is one of the key elements that makes Tai Chi effective at improving balance, coordination, and strength. Do your movements slowly, smoothly, and continuously. Make them continuous like water flowing in a river. Maintain the same speed throughout. Imagine you're moving against a gentle resistance. This will cultivate inner force. Imagine the air around you is becoming denser and that every move you make is against a gentle resistance, almost like moving in water. Listen to your body and move within your comfort zone. The movements will be demonstrated in both sitting and in standing. If you're unable to perform the full range of movement that is demonstrated, you can perform half or a quarter of the amount of movement, or imagine yourself performing the movement. Two, the body. Optimal structure of the body improves the quality of movements and internal components. It connects the movements to the internal and enhances balance. Maintain an upright posture, well aligned in a straight vertical line. One way to keep an optimal alignment is to imagine you're going to sit on an empty chair, bending both your knees and hip joints. Practice it side on with a mirror and check yourself every now and then. Leaning far forward can compromise balance and leaning far backward can increase strain on the spine. Be conscious of weight transference to improve mobility and coordination. Draw awareness of each step as you transfer your weight. When you move forward, for example, put your weight on one leg while maintaining an upright posture. Touch down gently with the other heel first and then gradually place the entire foot on the ground and then slowly and consciously transfer your weight forward. 3. Internal Tai Chi is an internal art. Ultimately, we are controlled by our internal. The power of the mind has immense potential. Integrating mind and body is the ultimate aim of Tai Chi. When your mind is in good balance, so is your body. Loosen or song your joints. Song is a Chinese word which means both relaxed and loosened. It is ideal to relax when doing Tai Chi, but by relax, we do not mean let your muscles go floppy. Instead, consciously and gently stretch your joints from within, almost like you're expanding your joints internally. Jing, your mind, means to focus on your movements, and in Tai Chi means mental quietness or serenity. Imagine you're in a quiet and serene environment and your mind will also slow down, becoming quiet and serene. Keep yourself focused on practicing Tai Chi, your movements, breathing, balance and body alignment, and avoid any distraction. Jing is also being mindful of the moment. 4. Be mindful. Mindful of your breath, mindful of your weight transference, and mindful of the situation. Breathing. If you breathe slowly and deeply for a few moments, you may start to notice a feeling of relaxation and greater ease. Stress tends to increase our breathing rate. Mindful breathing leads to a relaxation response within our body and our mind. You may want to explore sensing the air entering through your nose, down your windpipe, filling the lungs and then the abdomen. You may notice a slight rising of your belly as you breathe in and a slight drawing in of the belly as you breathe out. 
physically, air doesn't enter your abdomen. It's simply an imagery tool to help enhance the contraction of your diaphragm muscle to open up more air space in your lungs. Weight transference. Being mindful of your weight transference improves balance, thus reducing the risk of falling. Optimal weight transference depends on good dynamic or moving and static or still postures. An upright and supple posture enhances mental alertness and strengthens the inner structures like the deep trunk and pelvic stabilizing muscles. Be mindful of weight transference starting from postural awareness. As you move in any direction, put your weight on one leg while maintaining an upright posture. Be aware of bending the knees, touching down gently with the heel, and gradually placing the entire foot on the ground, and then, slowly and mindfully, transferring your weight forward. Imagine the body as a string that is being stretched gently from both ends. Maintain postural awareness with stepping forward, backward, and then sideways being mindful of weight transference. Situation. Being mindful of where and what situation you are in at the moment makes you mentally more alert. Be aware of what situation you are in and focus on what you are doing. Walk with focus and be aware of your body, of where your body is and how weight is shifted. Thank you for participating in this Tai Chi for Rehabilitation program. May you be free from suffering and may you know peace and joy.